at their bodies. They've got massive boobs. Oh, I probably could have been done with not seeing that. Oh, what the hell is this? <laughs> oh my god, that may be the coolest thing I've ever seen my whole life. I'm so turned on. That guy lost an eye and literally said, "'Tis but a scratch." Okay, so this is a movie 300, and originally I thought it was a Gladiator movie, but I'm being told it's not. I don't know history, so I don't know what I'm going to watch. Like, really don't know. I just found it on the list. So I think if I watch this and I still want to watch a Gladiator movie, then I'm gonna have to watch Gladiator, because that's definitely a Gladiator movie. Right, guys, you have been smashing the likes and the subscribes and the post notifications and all that stuff, so just keep doing what you're doing. Not going to be that nagging wife to keep telling you to do something when you're already doing it and you're doing a grand job and I guess we're just gonna have to see what this 300 is. Do I make my predictions? Yes. 300 is the year. The year 300. Wait, is that going too far back? <laughs> I don't know. He always said I don't know history. No, I'm going with that. Even though I think I'm wrong, it's the only thing I can think of. It was based in the year 300. And you're all probably laughing at me right now. But listen, I have learned more from this channel than I ever did at school. <laughs> so this is my education now. And we're just going to start. 300 and play. Ooh, it's a blood splatter. When the boy was born, like old Spartans, he was inspected. Inspected for what? He was sickly or misshapen, he would have been discarded. Oh, that's baby skulls. From the time he could stand, he was baptized in the fire of combat. How old did he say? <gasps> oh. <laughs> Clever boy. Taught never to retreat, never to surrender the greatest glory he could achieve in his life. Is Sparta the king? What happened? Aww. At age seven. 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 The boy was taken from his mother and plunged into a world of violence. Oh, that's... To create the finest soldiers the world has ever known. Ow. And if necessary, to kill. Oh. Oh. The boy was punished. No. to show no pain. I don't like whips. I don't like whipping. No, 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 no. Constantly tested. Tossed into the wild. It was his initiation. Is he in his bare feet in the snow? That's bad enough. Oh. Get it. Go on, you can do it. He's a man now. The wolf begins to circle the boy. I thought he looked like a man. He's <laughs> maybe a still a boy. I know what he's a way to do. Yeah. Yeah, I knew it. You're too big. His form. Perfect. Well done. You can eat now. Returns to his people. A king! Our king! Leonidas! What? What? The boy is now the king. The boy is now the king? I don't, I don't know. A beast approaches, ready to devour a tiny Greece. Did he say we're in Greece? That's all I picked up from that. It was King Leonidas himself who provoked it. And there's an army coming. Oh, that's... Skulls with crowns on them, so they were important people. A Persian emissary awaits Leonidas. Hey, he's Leonidas. Do not forget today's lesson. Respect and honor. Respect and honor. God. Imagine. Poor boys. What do the girls do? Councilman Theron. You found yourself needed for once. Well, that's Cersei. What message do you bring? Earth and water. Mm -hmm. All the way from Persia for earth and water. It's a riddle. Do not be coy or stupid, Persian. What makes this woman think she can speak among men? <gasps> because only Spartan women give birth to real men. Ooh. All the God King Xerxes requires, offering of earth and water, a token of Sparta's submission. I don't like him. Submission. No, that's a bit of a problem. Well, he thinks that's Gerard Butler. Choose your next words carefully, Leonidas. They may be your last. Oh, really? He's threatening you now. Chop his head off. Put his crown back on his skull so that you'll have a skull with a crown on it. Oh, 
I've chosen my words carefully. Perhaps you should have done the same. This is blasphemy. Is it? <laughs> Are you not allowed to kill a messenger? I would. <laughs> Do it. Do it. Give him the nod. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. This is Sparta! Ooh. This is Sparta. Now, what have you just started? What's, what's down there? What's that a pit of? Snakes? That wolf things? We have been expecting you. Who's we? Oh, what's wrong with these face? <laughs> Who's we? The Ephors. Priests to the old gods. More creature than man. Oh. No Spartan king has gone to war without the Ephors' blessing. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I want to see this person. Creature thing. What do you offer? They all look the same. I thought there was going to be like a big king version of them that looked like a pig. We will block the Persian coastal assault. Now in that narrow corridor, their numbers will count for nothing. He's doing what he did with the wolf. Was that him at the start with the wolf? Yeah, it was. We must consult the oracle. Okay, who's the oracle? I want to see this oracle. Oh, I saw a nipple. Do no oracles glow then? I thought they all glowed. The ephors choose only the most beautiful Spartan girls as oracles. Oh. The old wretches have the needs of men. Ugh. Oh my god. Why why lick? What's with the licking? Sparta will fall. Oh Greece will fall. He's not gonna listen to what she just said. He just wants to save his Spart Sparta. Sparta. Barter. Truly, you're in the God King's favour now. And when Sparta burns, you... Sparta is Sparta. Thought I made that up. Fresh oracles shall be delivered to you daily. Oh, he's naked. He's naked. <laughs> I just saw his butt. The oracle's words can set fire to all that I love. So that is why my king loses sleep. Yeah, he's worried. There's only one woman's words that should affect the mood of my husband. Those are mine. But you are not the oracle. She wasn't pretty enough. <laughs> what should a free man do? Free man, yeah. She looks much better in this than she did in Game of Thrones. Is this all of them? As you ordered. 300. Oh, that's why it's called 300. He's... He's in... Oh, wait a second. He is your son. He is too young to have felt a woman's warmth. I have others to replace him. I have others to replace him. Bloody hell. Lord of the Rings. Yeah, I think someone told me that the guy from Lord of the Rings is the narrator for this. I maybe have that completely wrong because I read a lot of things that you tell me. <laughs> but I think I'm right. Faramir. The Spartan army must not go to war. I'm here, just taking a stroll, stretching my legs. He's giving nothing away. I suppose I'll head north. The hot gates. What's the hot gates? Mama! Why are they all naked? <laughs> Do they not need body armor? They only have pants on. Come back with your shield or on it. Yes, my lady. Or on it. Why are on it? Only the hard and strong may call themselves Spartans. Who decides? Who decides if you're hard and strong? We march for our lands. Look at their bodies. They've got massive boobs. It was wrong to expect Sparta's commitment to at least match our own, doesn't it? Why is he so confident? I'm a potter. And you? Oh, yeah, what yeah. What is your profession? Sculptor, sir. Yeah. None of them are hard and fast. No, what did he say? Hard and strong. What is your profession? <laughs> What's their profession? I brought more soldiers than you did. Yes. They are hard and they are strong and they have big boobs. What did they say their profession was? His only regret is that he has so few to sacrifice. To sacrifice? We're being followed. It has followed us since Sparta. It. It looks big, whatever it is. Oh, it's not a giant. I thought it was a giant. It's not. It's somebody there. I thought it was a giant. Claws and fangs, so it wasn't people, it was the wolf things. 
I'm so confused. Have the gods no mercy. What is that? We are doomed. Show me. Not these immortals. Immortals. We'll put their name to the test. Let me see. Oh. Oh, I probably could have been done with not seeing that. Oh, there's that Into thing. Into that narrow corridor. Is that is wearing your same uniform as you guys? Into hell's mouth we march. Whoa! Oh god, you guys are screwed. Put these motherless dogs as they're embraced by the loving arms of Greece herself. That's Faramir. True. I think he was a baby that was discarded, but he survived. And in the background, he trained and fought, and now he wants to be part of the army. Wow, you guys are tough. Only one among us keeps his Spartan reserve. Only our king. So hot. <laughs> I'm so turned on. I'm so confused by these uniforms. Half of them are butt naked. Half naked. <laughs> Their butts aren't out. That would have been cool. And then he's got bondage on. I've never met an adversary who could offer me what we Spartans call a beautiful death. There might be one who's up to the task. Ah. Oh, that's not nice. I don't like that. I demand that someone show me your commander. Someone harpoon him. Throw that big rock at him. These hills swarm with our scouts. Why is he being so bold? Uh-huh. Someone could literally just chop your head off right now. You will pay for your barbarism! Oh, with a whip. Yeah, your whip's no match to these guys. Well, I did try and warn you. My arm! It's not yours anymore. Wow, these guys are amazing. By noon this day, you will be dead, man. I don't think so. Our arrows will blot out the sun. I don't think you know who you're up against. The wall is solid. It'll do the job of funneling the Persians into the hot gates. Oh yeah, he's still doing that plan then. Captain, have the men found any route through the hills to our back? There is such a route, good king. <gasps> Not one step closer. I think he's okay. Monster. No, I think he's fine. I humbly request an audience. Look at him, he's so freaking cute. <laughs> <laughs> my mother's love led my parents to flee Sparta, lest I be discarded. Ah. Uh. To redeem my father's name by serving you in combat. He's got the muscles. <laughs> mm -hmm. I like him. Raise your shield as high as you can. Oh no. He's got one, one little arm. Oh, he's got one little arm. Your father should have taught you how a phalanx works. He could do it with his other arm. I am sorry, my friend, but not all of us were made to be soldiers. Show him. Show him what you can do. Earthquake. No, Captain. It's not an earthquake. It's flying. What's that? Is that dragons? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is where they die! And the shield boys! Um, but there's so much more. Spartans, lay down your weapons! They're, they're not going to do that. <laughs> the hell did that... Oh, it's the guy. It's the man. Is it him up the top? Is it the deformed man up at the top? Did he just do that? <laughs> I don't want to see any of you die. Wow. I'm impressed. That's amazing. They're like building a wall and then and then opening it and whoosh, and then quickly closing it again. That's so cool. I see a lot of blood flying about. They are fearless. Oh, 
Oh God, I felt that one. Oh, it went right through my spine. I like it. I like the slow motion. <gasps> it took his whole leg off. I really like it. <laughs> Run away. Run away, boys. To the cliffs! Oh, they are, they're backing up. <laughs> you might as well jump. Hell of a good start. What are they saying? <gasps> Run. Holy crap! Recover! I like hedgehogs. Did none of them get hit? None of them were hit. That's mad. Today, no Spartan dies! Okay, I believe him. I love the colours. Beautiful. Red. Red and brown. Oh, the horse's legs. Poor horse. We do what we were trained to do. What we were bred to do. What yeah. we were born to do. Yeah. It's going right through them. They're like Play-Doh. No mercy. Oh. A good start. They're so strong. Take my hands. They're so giddy. The Persians are approaching. Small contingent. Too small for an attack. I'll leave you in charge. I love how casual they're just like killing everyone in the back. Oh, I thought there was dragons, but there was no dragons. <laughs> Must have just been big birds. You must be Xerxes. Xerxes. Oh, bloody hell. Come, Leonidas. He's very full of himself. Let us reason together. Holy crap, he's big. Consider the fate of your women. Clearly, you don't know our women. I might as well have marched them up here, judging by what I've seen. <laughs> your Athenian rivals will kneel at your feet, if you will, but kneel at mine. Nah, he doesn't want that. Such an offer only a madman would refuse. And you're a madman. That few stood against many, and before this battle was over, that even a god king can bleed. Ah, I think he's right, you know. I hope so, anyway. How those Persians high? But unless I miss my guess. Holy crap, that's a massive wall of Persians. You've gone pissed him off now. He'll come back with more, maybe more that are the same size as him, because he was really big. The Immortals. Mm-hmm. It's so terrible, but it's also so funny. Spartans! Push! Oh, clever. That, I think you only got one of them, so. It would have been cool if they managed to get, like, a heap more. Did I just see a Spartan die? Because I didn't want that. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh oh, guys, guys, look. Oh, oh. I, don't, I don't know if I can watch this. Oh. oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, oh. it cut the hairs off. You're gonna need more than one of you guys to fight him. Oh. <gasps> He's gonna have a really cool eye scar now. Keep your slivers to yourself. In his head. In his eyeball. Either of those. That's it. In his eyeball. 
Oh, he's gonna take it out! <laughs> oh, get him in the head! Yes! Why was he so squishy? <laughs> they make a wondrous mess of things. Mm-hmm. Brave amateurs. They do their part. I think it's Faramir that's doing the narrating, but his voice has changed a little bit and it sounds very sexy. He felt like a domino. They fail our king's test, and a man who fancies himself a god also just fancies himself. Look at, look at him. Just a diva. And now he's mad. He's even madder than he was before. Oh, and our honoured dead. Oh. I think they're just saying "ah oh. 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 Even oh. the king allows himself to hope. That's not an occupation. Ah oh. Oh, what the hell is this? That's a rhino. How where did they find a rhino? It's still going. Oh god, it's still going. Did it just fall? It did, it just fell. I thought it was gonna keep going. I can't believe how tough these guys are. This isn't a true story, is it? Epic. Oh. Your shields are protecting you from everything. What the hell is that? Oh my god, that may be the coolest thing I've ever seen in my whole life. Did they just chop his arms off and then add that things on? It's like, it's like crab hands. Now I do like an elephant. They shouldn't be used in wars. Are they, are they still in the same place? They're clumsy beasts. Ah. Uh, Oh, oh no, that was a shame. I don't, the poor elephants. Yeah, are they still in the same place? And that king guy just keeps sending more and more. And they keep knocking them down. I love how they've done this, where it keeps going slow motion, then fast, and then slow, and then fast, and then slow, and then fast. Astonos, my son! Oh, oh. Watch. Watch. Oh no. <gasps> oh no. You were too distracted. You, that was your fault. Upon seeing the headless body of his own young son, the captain breaks wreck. He goes wild. And now he's going to be too distracted and he's going to end up dying too. What the hell are these Persians on? <laughs> This is just a goat man right there. What? Why are they chopping arms off? And what's he doing there? You're way to be a traitor, aren't you? Embrace me as her king and as her god. Yes! I, I can't. <laughs> we all deserve a bit of loving. I thought that was going to go the complete opposite way. I thought he was going to prove himself. I need your help in winning votes to send the army north to our king. <laughs> oh, you're going to pay for that. Just you wait till her husband gets home. What do you have to offer in return for my word that I'll help you send our army north? Don't do it. This will not be over quickly. Lovely. You will not enjoy this. Disgusting man. I bet he still won't help her. Scratch hasn't made you useless. It's just an eye. God so fit to grace me with a spare. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. That guy lost an eye and literally said, "'Tis but a scratch." A hunchback traitor has led Xerxes' immortals to the hidden goat path behind us. Mm-hmm. Spartans never retreat. Oh, Spartans yeah. never surrender. Oh, yeah. I remember that. We will stand and fight. How many of you are left? I don't see 300 of you. But I didn't to begin with. <laughs> the 300 Spartans gave their last breath to defend it! Oh, oh, that's what that's what they're saying. Oh, oh. 
I can do that too. Look at, look at his body. That yeah, is not normal. So hard. You will deliver my final orders to the council. Tell a victory. Victory. No victory yet. Oh, I thought he just pulled his ponytail off. <laughs> I thought it was like clipped on. I thought he just pulled it off. <laughs> Tonight we died in hell. Oh, they think they're all going to die. Maybe they will. Your husband has brought war upon us. You are wrong. Xerxes brought it forth. And before that, his father, Darius, at Marathon. I don't know Darius, but yeah, the other one did, yeah. But what of adultery? How dare you? Oh, yeah, I thought I thought he was going to do that. <gasps> Just hours ago, you offered yourself to me. I would have her sent on me still. Just deny it. He can't prove it. <laughs> wow. But quickly. You will not enjoy this. Oh. God, he's so extra. I love it. Use your reason. Think of your men. Shoot him now. Um, harpoon him. You will be proclaimed warlord of all Greece, answerable only to the one true master of the world. Master of the world? If you but lay down your arms and kneel to holy Xerxes. He's not going to do that. Harpoon them both. Him and the hunchback guy. I spear them, I mean spear. <laughs> What's a harpoon? Yeah, you better feel bad. Oh. Can't do that. You're so close. Aha, I knew it. I knew it. No way he was gonna give in that easy. His helmet was stifling, narrowed his vision, and he must see far. Oh. His shield was heavy. It threw him off balance. Oh. And his target is far away. Are you gonna get him? Oh, please get him. Right between the eyes. Oh no, it missed him! Shit! It missed him! Damn it! Oh, I feel very emotional now. I really didn't want it to miss. His roar is long and loud. No. It's an honor to die at your side. It's an honor to have lived at yours. Oh, that's so sad. They couldn't just have the pointy arrows. They needed to have points and jaggy bits and more points. Oh, definitely got them that time. I thought they were going to send the army. That little hunchback man is not cute anymore. Well, this is sad. Remember us, he said to me. Whoa. Also, I like how they did that. He narrated the movie and now he's telling the story at the end. Thanks, his heart. Face obliteration. Oh. Yeah. Oh, ahoo. Oh. <laughs> Three to one! The odds for any Greek! Holy crap, look at the army now! Tell Leonidas and the brave 300 the victory! Yes! The end, and they killed them all. Every single one of them. Very nice, very nice. Although I would have loved to have seen the Persian king god thing die. I don't think that was fair. We didn't get to see that. I'm so very, very, very impressed with the 300. They're so brave and so hard and so strong. Imagine what they would have had to do, the training before that movie, to get their bodies in that shape. Because they were all the same. They all had massive boobs and massive six packs. It was like a more bloodier version of Magic Mike. I was told already that Faramir from Lord of the Rings was the narrator through this and I 
didn't remember. I just remembered once I seen him and then I was like, oh yeah, I know now. But I don't think I would have realised that was his voice if he wasn't in it. It sounded a little nicer. I liked it. Oh, we didn't get to see the big fat thing with the arms like this fighting properly. Why didn't we get to see that? There was a lot of weird looking things in this movie. A lot of arms chopped off. A lot of sexually disturbing things. Oh yeah, we should have saw the hunchback man die as well. A few things didn't happen that I would have liked to have happened, but it was still an all round awesome movie. Was there a 302? Gerard Butler, I recognise him because I've seen him in Law Abiding Citizen, which is also another good movie. So as far as I understood, the Persians were trying to take over that man, what was his name? It sounded like Cersei, but it wasn't Cersei. The God King. He was trying to take over the whole world, but King Leonidas said, no, you will not take Sparta. He wanted Sparta to be free, with free men and women and children. But that weird goblin people thing said, no, you can't go to war. So he made a smaller army of only 300 Spartans and they killed a hell of a lot of Persians just wasn't able to cross the finish line but they were close they were almost there and if they'd had the rest of the army's help they would have smashed it no problem so what was the issue with them going to war in the first place is what I don't understand. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to Google a few things or I'll just wait until this video is uploaded and you guys can tell me everything. If you like this video, then you know what to do. Like, subscribe, post notifications, Patreon. Patreon for the full unedited version. And I think that's me for today. I think I had other questions, but I don't remember them right now. If I remember, then I'll pop them in a comment. You guys cover everything anyway, so I don't even really need to ask. And that's awesome. Was this a true story? It can't have been. I mean, it could have been. I did think there were dragons at one point and then I thought, nah, can't be a true story. But it turned out they were seagulls. Right, I'm gonna go. Thank you, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.